Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your June 2019 general reading. So this is a general reading. It will resonate with those who uh, it resonates with. If it doesn't resonate with you, check your uh, moon rising sign or another reader. Um, thank you to those who subscribe, like the videos and comment. Make sure you are commenting below because... Um, commenting a yes or a no question below because I'll choose a series or a number of questions uh, to answer for free every Friday and your question could be selected so make sure you comment a yes or no question below in regards to this reading right okay so let's get into it I've already pulled the cards just for the sake of time all right so the situation the advice and the outcome all right so the situation is that there may be an offer, um, an offer made to the Aquarius or the Aquarius makes to another person in which it completely shifts the energy for Aquarius and or the other person or for the both of you. Um, there is an emotional offer. This is like someone saying, let's start our relationship back up the Aquarius may have been on the journey of maybe just being single or dating other people um kind of avoiding the the idea the notion that that we could start this back up this could be a new person this can be an old person but I really feel with the other cards this might be an old old person coming back and we will clarify over the other side. But anyhow, um, the advice is the Prince of Pentacles. Whatever this offer is, it had been a long time coming for the Aquarius. This may have been a situation where the Aquarius was the other person or there was a, a title on the relationship. There might have just been a, an understanding. And now this person is coming back or this person wants to establish or, or reestablish a real relationship the advice is for the Aquarius to listen to their intuition you know intuitively and instinctually which way to go to a wands which choice to make the additional advice card that I pull was the eight of swords in reverse it says come out of feeling stuck stagnant and in, in thought come out of circular negative thoughts so those are the thoughts that just keep circulating in your mind up to where you're in a circle right and, and you aren't making a decision come out of that in regards to this offer you could be dealing with the Sagittarius a cancer we have two horses here then we have the chariot here you could be dealing with a uh, Piscean person. You could be dealing with a Leo. You could be dealing with, um, yeah, Scorpio, Gemini. Okay. Um, at the bottom of the clarifying deck, we have the Two of Cups. At the bottom the initial spread we have a star it says heal heal this relationship someone wants to renew heal restore all about re 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 re-upping a connection that could be mutually beneficial in the outcome we have the five of pentacles in a death card this says that there's a particular aquarius who is resting in not having a lot of confidence that this could actually change, transform, go into something better. So there might be an Aquarius who is contemplating just ending the relationship in its entirety. To clarify the Five of Pentacles in the Death card, we have the Chariot, the Six of Wands. This has been a long time coming, a journey for the Aquarius. In this relationship, you learn things about yourself, about what you will accept, 
what you will not accept, self-worth, uh, um, depriving yourself, uh, and putting other people before yourself. So many things the Aquarius has learned. This has been a journey. Uh, one that will will and is uh, uh, coming out to be a very victorious one. This person is coming back from the past for their own reason. The reason may be is that now they understand what you meant to their life, what you are, what you bring to the table. How happy Ten of Cups they are with you. This person really wants to transform the relationship. They may even want to marry you, get engaged. They want to house a happy home, family with you. They're very much in love with you. But the strength card is here. So that tells me that there was some devil-like energy, some toxicity, some lies, deceit, third party, sex addiction, or or just more so obsession here. Um, there was a, a time when the Aquarius would do anything for this person. I think the Aquarius has walked away, or some of you have walked away from that that notion of just wanting to lay yourself on the tracks for this person uh, and once you walked away gain clarity about what this situation it was to you in the past you gained that self value and worth and self esteem you look very attractive to this person you've been like kind of like pushing energetically this person away and maybe it's because they weren't ready but it looks like somebody is ready to give you what you want, if you will allow it. You're going to need to have strength to even deal with this person, um, this relationship. You're going to have to kind of push the ego down a bit. Or maybe this person has pushed their ego away. Now it's just true love. Uh, let's see what her... Angel Answers cards have to say. And we're going to clarify over the other side to see if the Aquarius will take this person back, if they should. That's one of the questions we'll ask the cards. Yes, within the next few months. <laughs> if you believe, ask your angels at the bottom of the deck. All right. For some of you, this may be career. Some of you going in more, you know, you want to be more um, altruistic or, yeah, you want to have more charity associated with the work that you do. You want to be a giver. Also, you want to be able to take care of yourself, but you also want to feel good, emotional fulfillment within your career sector. Some of you may be contemplating going into another career or a career that has something to do with a more charitable base. Um, some of you are of two minds about get going into this career. The advice here, once again, you, you, you've tried to cultivate this for a long time. It's been a long time coming. It's here. The advice is to come out of the overthinking, the negative thoughts, and, and make the decision to move into this because you can have true happiness. Uh, victory, self-promotion, people helping you, success in your business, help in this business. If you just maintain, for some of you, you feel as if it won't be enough. It won't be enough for you monetarily. Um, so you want to end it. Or you don't know how you can transform the business or the career into bringing you enough money so that you can take care of yourself. The cards say, if you believe... Within the next few months, and yes, spirit will bring you a way of of, of get, coming to a place where you, you know you you won't be in lack with that five of pentacles. All right, so finances. What did I tell you? First card out. Decisions. Thank you, Lord God. This is on fire. I'm happy for the Aquarius and their religion and spirituality. For some of you, 
adult children are coming up and manifesting here too. Um, some of you, you want to work with young adults or you work with young adults or you have a young adult who is playing a big part in what you want to do or or money. You know, these kids cost money, right? Um, <clears throat> so that's definitely for those of you who came for the career, the career word from the Lord, there it is. Um, you will be able to transform. You will be able to have finances. We're going to clarify all of this over the other side. This looks amazing for the Aquarius. Not one bad card at all. I mean, the Five of Pentacles, but that's it. It's a mindset. Also, it's um, it's something. It's a minor arcana, so it can be changed. It's just about learning how to change and manifest. Um, as I say that, be sure to go over to my website and buy one of the green candles, and that's for money and prosperity. Uh, burn it. Uh, when you get it, burn it every night before you go to sleep. Say a small prayer after you burn it. Thank you, God, for more uh, money coming to me. If this is an issue for you, if it's not, then of course this doesn't relate to you. Um, this is the manifestation work you do. This is how you bring those things to pass. Those in heaven come down to the earth. It's for you. It's here for you. So, anyhow, um the link to purchase the candles will be is below the candles 350 um and there are other candles there are love candles there uh the stones will be uh, on the website soon um also purchase the extended reading especially if you are trying to make a career move to one that is maybe a social work tarot card reading psychotherapist therapist counselor Something to do with religion, spiritual healer, Reiki worker. I, you know, I mean, the list goes on and on, right? Where you want to do something that it feels good. You know, I feel good about what I'm doing. All right. Also, for those of you who want to know, if I should accept this person back into my life, it was hell the first go round. And, and I've gotten out of hell. I got to get out of hell free card. And now this person's coming back. No. Anyway, let's hashtag that. Get out of hell free car. Anyway, uh, thank you guys. Uh, take care. I hope that the reading resonated for you. Uh, make sure you're commenting a yes or no question below so that um, it could be, you know, selective to be on the live this Friday. You can get your question answered for free. Um, if it's not selected, you can still get your question answered there at the live. Um, thank you guys. Take care. Talk to you very, very soon. June looks like an absolutely beautiful month. All right. Bye.